how to design sales page or funnel project in Canva. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I am going to show you how you can create or design and also customize the sales page using uh, the free tool for design which is Canva. It is very easy and simple to do. All you have to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning to the end and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is you go to canva.com. Once you are on your the website, you are simply going to sign into your account. Then you are going to create a design. You can go ahead on the search bar and type, for example, website like that website and see the templates that are available on the uh, library. As you can see here, we have a lot of options. Uh, to choose or you can simply click on create a design and here we are going to type simply website and it will give you the dimensions of that website and you are going to start from scratch i will say, let you see our on how we can start from scratch click on website and here it will be showing you the designer page we have here the page that you can see you can go ahead and make the width or the uh, height of the website as much as you want you can see here you can put it right here and also we have a stable uh, width this is very simple and very easy and here we have the designs that can go with the height that you have set for example like that it is a banner or with this it can be right here you can also put this height and you will see the uh, um, the templates that can go with this now let's go ahead and start creating the design i'm going to add another page to make this work then i'm going to unify a color for these let's say that i want to, to put this uh, this summer blue like that and here we have a first and second page let's go and add the third page and here for example i'm going to put some elements that you can see on the sales page i'm going to add a text let's go ahead and add and some headings for example i'm going to put home here we have home i'm going to change the color of it to the white color like that i'm going to make it smaller put it right here or maybe even smaller like that and then i'm going to duplicate it for this one like that and also duplicate it uh, for the third time i'm going to put for example product product like that uh, put this one as contact and here we are going to put for example shipping like that shipping and here we have it now i'm going to uh, space some of these elements so the uh, writing will not be confusing like that and here we have it now i'm going simply to add some elements let's go ahead and add some photos if you have some photos you can go ahead and upload it for example if you don't have you can use the photos within a canva for example we have a bakery this is the bakery photo you can go ahead and put this photo like that and i'm going to put simply this bakery let it appear like that and we here we have something i'm going to make it a little bit smaller to let everyone see that we have a bakery make it sm maybe even smaller put that bakery right here and here we go and here we have this design for example you can add or in place or in the place of this bakery you can go ahead and add some images that will show up the illustrations for example let's go ahead and put um let's see shopping shopping and we will see the images that are generated the photos you can go ahead and put for example this one this is a free image that you can use from canva put it like that make it a little bit smaller on the sides make it uh, to the middle a little bit and then we are going to put this one also we are going to put it like that simply make it a little bit smaller and here we go make this to that level and here we go now let's go ahead and add some products for example i'm going to put t-shirts like that t-shirt let's go and search for some products you can add some t-shirts like that 
you can go ahead and add some backgrounds to this one or you can add also some buttons i am going to put for example button button add a button to it let's go ahead and add this button particular button put it right here i'm going to make this button uh, change the color of it to this red or this uh, orange maybe then i will add a text to it which is a heading for example by now and here i'm going to change the color to that right here for example this is a buy now button i'm going to adjust that like that simply put it right here and here we go now i'm going to add a, a text box to make a description for it for example i can use the magic right or rewrite or put something right here i'm going to put a uh, summer like that t-shirt like that and here we have it this is the the heading for example you can go ahead and put or select the font of it i'm going to put a font for example like that here we have it put it right here and i'm going simply to add a, another text box which will contain normally the description description for example description of the a product like that here we have some description put it right here and here we have it i'm going to make it a little bit smaller and then for the alignment i'm going to align it to the left right here and here we have it this is for this product you can also add some galleries like that you can add some for example t-shirt just go ahead and put t-shirt like that and then we are, we are going to add the models to it for example this one i'm going to add it right here add this one also put it right here and for that one i'm going to put this also and make it a gallery for example and here we have it you can for example and put satisfaction satisfaction like that and see what we have here we are going to put here the type of satisfaction and put a box on it for example satisfaction of the clients to this product and here we have it i'm going to put like that make it a little bit smaller and then simply i'm going to put it right here select everything right here and put it in white so it will be more convincing maybe like that here we have it and here we have the sales page i'm going to delete that because i don't need it and here we have it then when you finish everything right here you are going to publish the website and get this sales page you can get a domain from canva and here we have these you can go ahead and link these if you have a lot of pages or a lot of product pages you can go ahead and link these it is very customizable all you have to do when you have a link or a page to it you can go ahead and put this click on the three dots click on link and here we have the uh, link you can go ahead and add a link to it or you can put some uh, some for example some pages number of pages or guide them to the page when simply click on website and it will be published that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and see you soon on the next one